Hi, welcome to Roll Initiative. I'm Alec, your Dungeon Master, and this is the party. Say hello, party. Hello, hello party. Hello, party. <laughs> we got some words from Verity. After a long day of protecting my friends, adorable mushrooms, and almost dying, do you know what I need? A little protection. And you know where I get that from? ExpressVPN. Protect your data today at expressvpn.com slash RTTV. Back to you. Huh. <laughs> Th thanks. Oh, thanks for that, so Verity. Good. Uh, Ga Gailey's gonna learn about the almost dying in a bit. Yeah, I know. She, no, she will. She no, might she will not. For one she week. Not. For one week. <laughs> Gailey yeah. doesn't need to know about that. <laughs> how, about, how about Ash giving us a quick recap before we hop in there? Then, yeah, huh? I can do that. So uh, we started off with the party on their way to go locate Hagen, only for Gilly to uh, put on the Umbero ring and promptly pass out. She was left <laughs> propped against a tree with Hobnob to watch over her and cook for her, um, while Taylor and Verity went off to the pond, where they found Hagen fishing with Verbena. It was all very nice. A couple little mushroom folk came up. It was really cute. It was endearing. And then the mushroom folk all got ensnared by some lily pad monsters who uh, dragged them into the pond and proceeded to start drowning them. Um, the party went in to help. Uh... Unfortunately, they were still a little rough from the last encounter. Don't know whose fault that is. Um, mm. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, some help from Gara turned out to be not so helpful as she proceeded to knock Verity unconscious, um, allowing her to start doing some death saving throws. Um, but it's okay, it's okay. <laughs> Taylor stabilized her, Hagen smeared some honey on her face, it's fine, she's fine, the mushroom folk are fine, it's all fine. We went back to find Gelly and Gelly woke up. It's fine. It's all fine. It's fine. It's fine. And I've that's been it. shaking my head vigorously throughout this whole summer. <laughs> 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 I can't this wait This is a pre-recorded episode. If you've been chatting with oh, us, yes. trying to get responses out of us, <laughs> we're, we're not there. <laughs> Yeah, but uh, we might be in chat. We, we might, might be. be in chat, but <laughs> yeah. like yeah, 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 yeah. we will us these portraits will not respond to you in real time. <laughs> yeah. Unless I don't know. Unless, yeah, Brock, that that was a weird thing you just said. <laughs> Hodglet, you get inspiration for that funny pun. <laughs> oh boy. Oh V2, oh, thank you for ha, checking ha, ha, our ha. stats real quick. <laughs> <laughs> Duo, what are you doing here? <laughs> Hi, Mom. Uh. <laughs> Hi, Ash's mom. Hi, Ash's mom. <laughs> okay. Oh, okay. Um, I think that's all it for intro stuff. Let's let's see how Gelly takes all the information of what just happened as we uh, hop back into the story. Or uh, how how do mushrooms walk? I just waddle? How, as we as we waddle. Normally they don't. Mushroom waddle and they just kind of. I waddle? guess mushrooms don't move. Yeah, because they're kind of top heavy. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <Tumble>? Okay. Bumble. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Bumble's bounce. <laughs> Bumble's bounce. So everyone has just uh, come back over to the clearing that you guys fought a a, a giant evil house, and mm -hmm. there's Gally just up against a tree, and she's just woken up. She's got some egg stuffed in her nose from Hobnob. Yeah, yeah, you are just hey. covered in in food from Hobnob. Ah, uh, Hobnob? Get okay, I cook. Yeah, boy. I cook. <laughs> Hobnob! Good. Hobnob, He's good. that's not her mouth. That's not her mouth. Don't are put there, it there. Are there eggs open her mouth. in my nose? Is this... You, you she's eat. gonna, like, blow out one nostril, <laughs> blow out the other. <laughs> Yolk comes out of each yep. other. Waste Stella. it! Waste it! Ungrateful! Ungrateful! Waste! That's no, not, no thanks! I no thanks! I, I, Hobnob, I, that's not how it works. I don't eat through this. I eat through this. <laughs> Wouldn't open that. I, I mean, so I, he's just gonna, like... <laughs> I was unconscious, <laughs> I guess. So, uh... Just for the record, Verity's laughing too because that was a funny line. <laughs> uh, Hagen, this is our this is our new friend Hobnob. Yeah, I was gonna say. Isn't um, he is cute? That a, that a frying pan. Yeah. Yeah. With, yeah. with legs. 
Yeah. He, All right. I, 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 he didn't try to eat yeah, us. The, 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 the talking did. killer house now makes a little bit more sense. You know, frying pans can do it. I guess houses can too, so. <laughs> you um, thought I was crazy. I just want one thing that's not supposed to be alive to not be alive. That's all I want. <laughs> oh god! You should have seen our mushroom friends. Where were they? Were at <laughs> yeah. What, how long was I out? It didn't. It, time is, I said, couple pretty weird. Couple hours. A, a couple hours. Maybe. Well, we found Hagen. Yeah. yeah. Hi. Hi. Hey. Uh, yes. Hi. I'm very glad you're saved alive. We need to some talk mushrooms. about your ability to Verity almost. Uh, uh, ta- uh, Verity elbows Taylor. Oh, mushrooms. Oh, you, okay. you some. Uh, you met mushrooms. Verity saved a mushroom. Yes. Uh, oh, yeah, and a lot of them. You look kind of rough. Friend... You guys look kind of like you. Are you okay? You look rough too. Actually. Well, I'm old, well, so well, there's. <laughs> I kind of we were, always we look were... like this. We were swimming in a lake that is also uh, a cheese pool. It's a long story. I'm sorry, is it but that's che- what? a cheese pool lake? Yeah, it's, a lot it's, of it's, cheese. It's, it's a lake, but we were in it. So, you know, I was in the water, so... so if, I'm, just if, I'm, swimming. If, I'm, if I'm looking at Verity, like, with even a degree of closeness, does she look <laughs> beat up? <laughs> yeah, you... And by this point, you know... You've been around Verity long enough to know when she's like lying or she's like trying to. Whispers. Yeah, no investigation check necessary. <laughs> she looks like no. she She's like you. Any insight check you make to, to Verity, you automatically succeed. Okay. <laughs> I'm just like you're lying. You're you are injured. What lake cheese lake were you in? I want to see got this like lake. A black eye. Yeah, where's this lake? I need a word with the lake, please. Hey, you're like the one that was. <laughs> you're the mm. one with egg up your nose. Let's not get into details of what's happened in the last couple of hours. I don't you got egg like on your I face. Just, <laughs> I don't look like I just got in a fist fight though with an egg. So yeah, I mean you do look like you got like bit by a house. I guess. Well, that was <laughs> true. But you were also just unconscious for a few hours, so you may have a concussion. I don't think I have a concussion. I think you have a concussion, and she's pointing at Verity. <laughs> I'm just like staring off the space. Wait, what? <laughs> uh, DM, real quick. What's up? Did Gara and them follow us here, or is it just us? That's a good question. Oh, uh, <laughs> yeah, Gara and them are with you. Okay. Oh, yeah. Taylor's gonna Gara's lean like, in. Hi, Kelly. We're here too. Taylor's oh God. Gonna lean into Kelly and be like, "We didn't invite them. They just, they just kind of followed us." You guys are running off somewhere, so we thought we'd uh come follow you since uh, you know, there was just a big fight over there and Verity almost died. I'm sorry. Nope. Yep, she Verity almost, almost. Verity almost died. No. I she mean, almost you, dived into the lake. lake of speech. That's what you Gara know? Said. She's just dying. <laughs> I, to- See I you. almost cried. No, I almost... she almost cried. No, dived the... like you know into the water. Dived, dived, dived. She's dived. gonna look at Gara dived. and be like, "Did you? Did you say died? Died? D I uh, like you know, like like I dye my 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 hair. I mean, it's you're not a natural red. redhead. It's but sometimes I, I go purple. You know, Gara, uh, Gara. That's what a nice fight? color. You guys know what I want." Some food that's not through my nose, and maybe a nap. <laughs> We're talking I, about this. We're gonna talk cook, about this. I can't I cook, just I cook. go almost get murdered when I go talk to Umbero. This is not how this works. <laughs> she died. Like, whoa, to- whoa, whoa! Murdered's a strong word. It was more of like a scuffle. There wasn't really a scuffle. It was more like a we were pool fighting. You know, like Chicken. when you. You jump around in a pool and you you roughhouse one another and Gelly's fake gonna- wrestle. Out of curiosity, uh, are the mushroom mm. folks also with us? <laughs> yeah, why not? They, they've just been <laughs> okay. oh, oh my god, they gonna, the whole I'm time. Gonna grab at, the, the sp- at their feet the whole time. I'm gonna grab the small tiny one and pick it up and be like, Kelly, look! And just like, did you do this? Her tiny mushroom She's gonna person. hold the mushroom and be like, did you do this? Was this your doing? <laughs> it's very <laughs> nice to meet you, Miss Kelly. If I, if I, if that's right, is that your name? Gal- yeah, Gelly is- Don't distract me! Hobnob Verity's is gonna- Verity's already- wa- Verity's trying to sneak away now. <laughs> we were being dragged into the water, and then Verity came in and rescued us. We were being dragged into the water? And then we tried to rescue her, 
And I tried to rescue Taylee. And you you were so because heroic. She me. Why why Thank was you I why, again? What? I was unconscious. You left me by a tree with a frying pan. And then you all almost got killed? I cook. <laughs> You're very, I'm sure, very good if, if I ate through the proper orifice, Hobnob. <laughs> Hobnob's going to point at the mushroom folk and be like, I cook? Oh. <laughs> oh, no. No. Oh, no. We're also in the cooking competition. Like, well. Oh, is is Verity in decent shape now? Like, is she okay? Not really. Okay, <laughs> no, so, no, no. so Gelly is she gonna. Said, none yeah, of us like really are. HP. <laughs> I have twelve HP. Oh my god, HP. you look horrible. <laughs> yeah, Gelly. I have some like more a honey. Mess. Gelly's going to go. The up. mushrooms also have like bandages on them too. They're all like they're all roughed up. Well, they seem okay. to have like vine burns on them. Why don't we let? Popping up, cook us all just a super quick meal, and then like Gelly, you tell us what happened because we didn't know you were slipping on that ring and you just fell over again. <laughs> we need to know what happened with you too. Well, I feel like I haven't really gotten an accurate description of what <laughs> happened to you. So we had a fight with some lily pads, and we're all fine. And then the the mushroom <laughs> to you, Gelly, is like, yeah, we were dragged underwater. That doesn't sound fine. And almost squeezed to death. That really doesn't Yay! sound <laughs> fine. I mean, oh. there's worse ways to go if you but think about it. But we saved you guys. Yeah. Oh, by the way, hi, Gally. My name's Button. It's nice to meet <gasps> you. <laughs> Button, I'm just, um, I'm so That's happy to meet you. That's the name of the smallest mushroom. Yes, I'm very happy Button to meet mushroom. you. I'm very mushroom. concerned <laughs> about your well-being. <laughs> Don't worry, I'm fine. Taylor rescued me. <laughs> and then you tried to rescue me too. It was so yeah, cute. I tried to so hard, but my hands are so short. <laughs> Alec, I need you to stop right now, or we are adopting this one too. <laughs> and How many voices do you want to have to be responsible for? <laughs> oh god. You gotta mm -hmm. stop, bud. <laughs> Button's got their own family. They're they're like part of this mushroom brigade. So Gally. what you're saying is we have That's to adopt true. all we of them. We can't just take them. <laughs> all the mushrooms. <laughs> they are quite uh, small. We can absolutely take them. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, they are. They're only. What did I say? They're like a foot and a half tall. Yeah. Oh no, buttons a foot and a half tall. Everyone else is two feet tall. The other mushrooms. Are yes. Two feet tall. Yeah, because they were just a little smaller than Verity. Yeah. I yeah. Cook. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Yes. And then yes. Hobnob, go, go ahead and cook. The mushrooms go over to Hobnob, and they're like, "You cook? Yay! No vegetables for us. We're carnivorous." You're carnivorous. Oh. <laughs> it's it's yeah. good. It's good. I cook. I cook. And uh, yeah, he has some eggs. He also has the bird. <laughs> and then an one, one of the mushrooms face. is like, "Oh, <laughs> you can cook these too." And they just put like like five pounds of ground beef right in front of you. It was I in the water, in it was in the cheese pocket. pond. Ew. <laughs> I cook. <laughs> <laughs> you know what'd be nice right now? A long grass. I'm so tired. <laughs> <laughs> I feel great. Um, I feel all right. I'm, I'm not really a restful I'm when hurting I... a little. Oh, God. Yeah, Verbena's like, well, yeah, we've had quite a day. Why don't we all just start heading home? I like cook. After um, after Hopnob cooks real quick. Oh, okay. Yeah, and Gelly, why don't you? Yeah, uh, Gelly. You said you spoke with Umbero. Yeah. Was a... We're dying to know. Well, literally dying. It sounds like. <laughs> She's just gonna <laughs> narrow. Haley just I'm... bust out laughing. <laughs> narrow her eyes. See, it, we can her all eye. laugh about it now. <laughs> I don't think we can. I don't. It's another uh, adventure for the book, right, Verity? <laughs> yes. 
Kelly's gonna book. Kelly's gonna just touch lightly under uh, Verity's <laughs> black eye and be like, "Oh yeah, sure," and then cast a uh, Balm of Summer Court to do a little <laughs> bit of healing. Um, it's just enough for the black eye. The rest yeah, of her literally is just, just so enough. Messed up. How, how much is that? It will be. I have to roll. You're gonna right. get one temp. Um, why is this being okay? It's a d6. Um, I have to roll. Oh, it's a six. Uh, I throw my teeny tiny dice because they were the only ones I could find from my. I packed. That's perfect. If, if people, if I did, if it wasn't mentioned, I've been. I was moving. That's why I wasn't here, and so all my stuff is gone. I don't know where any of it is, but I found my teeny tiny dice. Um, so it'll be six plus one temporary hit point. Hell yeah. Um, Okay. It was, it was a heck of a black eye. It was actually that, like, it was disconnected, and you couldn't even, she couldn't even see out of that Her eye. eye was disconnected? But what? Now, like now a you small dog. It. Detached oh. retina? <laughs> like, <laughs> yeah, a detached retina. What? That was oh seven HP worth of healing in her eye. Oh my I was wondering why God. she kept staring at me. <laughs> <laughs> Oh my god. This is extremely gruesome, more than we agreed upon. Gelly will be just... like, trust me, having one eye is not at all it's cracked up to be. I know I make it look cool, but she'll <laughs> heal it. And you really are the coolest person I know. You do make it look cool, Gelly. It is pretty cool. Okay, this isn't distracting me from the fact that you all <laughs> almost got murdered. I'm fine. <laughs> Yeah, um, Barrow, just, story just Garo time. just punched her so hard. Oh yeah, let's do it. Yeah. Really? So <laughs> let's get off the eyeball. <laughs> <Yeah>. Right? <laughs> that I certainly did not cause. That's what Gara said while holding up her claw. You need to shut your mouth. Gelly's yeah. eyes are like <laughs> sorry. Eyes like what? Um right, so <laughs> um, Barrow. <laughs> Yeah. Well, I so, put the ring on and then. Yeah, you felt <laughs> like you guys were running <laughs> away from the house towards mm -hmm. um, the lake where Hagen was. And you felt, you know, the ring calling to you, Gelly. And when you just <laughs> stuck your hand in your pocket, you. Um, when you just first put it in, yeah, you know, it just went right onto your finger. You didn't intend to, like, Ugh. put it on your finger. You were going to grab it, but mm -hmm. yeah, it went right on there. And you were zipped right into Umbero's little pocket realm. And you tripped in there on, oh. on a piece of driftwood. In the desert. Driftwood? Yeah, because oh, he's in that little Oasis island place. Oasis. Yeah. That's uh. why she tripped last time. And <laughs> yeah, it, it, all right. In the last session, you just fall over. Oh. I did. Yeah, when you put your hand in your pocket. <laughs> she just yeah. misses over. Um, okay, so it's if like, I'm... Oh! <laughs> Sorry, Kelly. Um, don't uh, know why you popped up over there in that particular spot. I didn't even... I don't even... Don't think I meant to put the ring on. I was just gonna check it. Oh, yeah, I was calling you. Oh. Oh, well, I did... I. Did I miss something? Uh, I was trying not to get eaten alive by a, a house. I don't know if you know that's a thing that can happen, but apparently it can, Amaro, because yeah. life is just a ceaseless stream of nightmares that we never wake up from, <laughs> in case you weren't aware. Yeah, I miss it. Adventuring, scuffling about like you youngins. God, it's uh, terrible. But that was a thousand years ago. L literally. So, oh God, yeah, that sounds it's been a while. Terrible. That sounds. T I mean, I'm sure it's great being alive that long. I couldn't do no, it. No, but... I've I've been in this ring for a thousand years ish. That's even more horrible. I mean, sorry. Anyway, what was your message? You had to. You said you were calling <laughs> oh, me. Oh yeah, I uh, I figured you were done, like dealing with the house thing. Oh yeah, I can kind of tell what you're doing out there. Oh, is but, it like um, a, uh, help, help, the person with the ring's about to die kind of thing, or what? No, no, uh, I just, I just, fi I just figured you were done with the house, so I, uh, oh. I was trying to talk to you earlier, but oh, yeah. you were ignoring me. Well, yeah, okay. the whole I trying not got, to get murdered. I know you've got stuff happening out there. Yeah, 
Okay. Uh, so what was the, um, what's the message? What's the update? You know everyone thinks I'm, I'm like, losing my mind because of you. That's neither here nor there. <laughs> but, but what's important is you know the truth, Kelly. Do I? Am I losing my mind? Okay. You know what? I it's mean, fine. you've, you've found a few artifacts, haven't you? We have. We have. I know yeah. you said there's more. So, there's more. Yeah, we need there's to find. more. That's specifically why I brought you back here, because there's yeah. one nearby, oddly enough. Oh, is it the, which, is it the armor? I think it was the armor, yeah, yeah. that I was sensing. But, what did it look like? Uh, it looked like armor. <laughs> yeah, um, <laughs> you remember it looking like it was, like, really gaudy and, um, <laughs> It's covered saying... in like weird, because it, it it's like, it's the armor that's the prize for the competition. Right. And it's held up in the center of the square. And right. um, since Gelly is not a very like yeah. material person, Realistic. she's just like, it, it just, just looks like armor. Just like armor, I guess. I don't really know if there's. Yeah, anything. it's got like croissants for horns. It's got like an oven in its belly. It's oh, got, okay. Like, Even Gelly would be able to on say. Its shoulders. It was kind of ugly armor, <laughs> uh, if I'm honest. Not my style. Um, but yeah, there's a really intense set of armor that's sort of like a prize for this competition in town. Or is that what you're talking? That can't be what you're talking about. Is it? Yes, but it shouldn't look ridiculous. It, I mean, he was a bit of an extravagant fellow, but. I'm talking about my, my friend ban Banbrek Thunderhorn. Thunderhorn. You've met one of his descendants. Yeah. Yeah, Branna. Mm -hmm. Yeah. How's he doing? Um. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> He's with his family. Oh. Okay. Yeah. Um. Oh. Great. <laughs> It's not a lie. It's it not feels a lie. terrible. <laughs> <laughs> He's with his family. Anyway, <clears throat> so by not weird, <laughs> by not weird, I mean, uh, it looks like it's baking themed. Baking. It, am baking I themed like? This is Hannah. Am I wrong? That's what yeah. it is. Yeah. That's yeah? What it okay. Like. So she. I'm just making sure Kelly's <laughs> not. Yeah, like, like, you know, bready, like a bready Br armor. I, that was not my friend. Brand book, uh, Brand, br bleh. Ban <laughs> Breck. It's B-A-N-B-R-E-K. This is Alec talking. <laughs> I love the idea that Umbero's like, it's spelled like this. <laughs> right? Ben I, no, Ban Breck. Ban Breck was... He was known as Banbrek the Wrestler. Mm. Yeah, that that guy was crazy. He would <sighs> he would wrestle giants with his bare hands. Uh, are fun. we sure? Are we sure this Just is to, like brag? The same armor? Could there be like a like a it different? It has been a thousand years, so maybe somebody found it and messed it up somehow. Like redecorated uh, it, refinished. That's, that's a possibility. Yeah, how, maybe how... it's it's a certain piece of the armor. Oh. But yeah, you guys have to get it. Oh. Um, uh, it's well. definitely something you need. Okay, but it's you have it's to win. It's very powerful, by the way. Uh, how so? Ooh. Well, he could he could control specific elements very well. Of of like Light, lightning. With the thunder horn that that thunder seems to be a family trait electricity yeah okay um we have to win a competition to get it i don't know well, that any of us why don't you just take it ta oh <laughs> lives are at stake here <laughs> oh yeah i guess we could just like steal it yeah i don't think verity will much take to that idea but uh, <laughs> yeah that is an option. I, I have a feeling they're gonna wanna win it fair and square, but B plan could definitely be thievery for sure. That 
his armor could make you literally shoot electricity. Bolts of lightning. I mean, I can I can shoot other stuff right now, so I'm you know, <laughs> kind of full up on my shooting elemental stuff. I mean, it can't hurt to have it, but more concerned about who else could get it. Probably like the weirdo who was like a wolf in sheep's clothing and, you know, stole stuff. Like, I don't want that guy to be able to shoot lightning. You know what I mean? Yeah. I miss adventuring. Did no. I tell you this one time, Van Breck was taking us to go fight his nem his arch nemesis, Jarl Rimther, Lord of the Frost, Tri Frost Giants, undisputed ruler of Icewind Dale. <laughs> oh, he really had it for that guy. And oh, Van, yeah. Van Breck never took anything seriously. Like, he was drunk half the time. But when it came to Jarl, boy. Ah. Uh, yeah, well, he had something about, like, the Frost Giant Raiders had destroyed part of his family home or something. I feel like I should be taking notes. No, <laughs> it's, it's not important. Yeah, okay. I was just thinking of a time. He, he just, oh boy, he messed up Jarl. But he left him alive because he was just like, they, they, they had like a, a mano a mano fight, like, where we were like, hey, hey, Banbrek, you want us in on this fight? And he's like, nah. And then he just took the armor off and he was just like all of his muscles and bare chested and he's like you and me Jarl let's finish this and then Jarl like told his minions to like stand down and then he took his shirt off boy it was wild especially since he's a frost giant and Banbrek's like a dwarf right yeah so, <laughs> not I think Jarl yeah. had a crush <laughs> <laughs> <It> sounds <laughs> like <laughs> right yeah, yeah. <laughs> That's the vibe I'm picking up. I'm getting like long enemies to lovers vibes out of this yeah. situation. We'll ship it. <laughs> uh, so uh, read the, about it in the hunky cat the interparty <laughs> relationships. Oh my god! Galley's <laughs> uh, been just well, like just really into dwarves, you know, fiddling with the <laughs> ring this whole time, debating at what point it's appropriate for her to <laughs> like leave. <laughs> She's like, every time she thinks the story's almost over, she's like, oh. Hmm. Huh? Well. <laughs> Sorry. Yeah. No, no. Gosh, I just I kept you here for a while. No, no. That's a very that interesting friends, story yeah. about those um, ex-boyfriends. But I, ah, um, we were not. No. I mean, we were close, but we oh. never like. Yeah. I, just, I mean, I, I. It's just I was hearing shirts were coming off, and there's a lot of passionate feelings. So uh, muscles, that's... muscles. So will they? Won't they? Well, yeah, it's just grudges. I, I mean, as and... a druid, I just like. I, I, I appreciate nature in all yeah. its forms. Mm. Yep. Yes. The physical For some, form. Somewhere you hear a voice, make it gay. <laughs> <laughs> Kelly's just like, uh, no, no, I just. Does that um, make Umbero pan? Mm -hmm. <laughs> uh, Kelly's just like, I just, I just know you said oh, that this is, this is a matter of life and death that we get the suit. So I just didn't know. If the, I mean, if like Yarl... in general, not at this particular moment, life and death. Oh, just... why did you, did, so there's nothing life and death going on right now, currently? Is there? I just, you, you guys said... just finished fighting the house. I heard yeah. you were just running to a lake. Yeah, I was, just, I was just curious if you had like a sense about myself and my party members, like if- No, I only usually sense what you're doing and looking at uh, since you're a druid. Mm. Kind of in tune. So you can like, yeah. you had everything you say? No, that? it's more okay. of like vague feelings. Oh, is it mostly yeah. just like rage? Yeah, you're angry a lot. I used to be so yeah. angry when I was your age. Yeah, well, I don't know that I'm going to grow out of it, you know. <laughs> you might. You might At just start forgetting things like I do since I'm just, you know, kind of a figment of my own imagina imagination. Yeah. Are you saying you're not real, Umbero? I mean, I'm, I'm, this is just like an echo of my, like, old self. Umbero, this uh, isn't you. You're it's making me, me feel like I am just... actually like as lo as loose in the head as everybody thinks I am, and I'm not loving that for me. Uh, 
I mean, I the this magic isn't gonna last forever. Eventually, my consciousness in this ring will fade. So yeah, little bit of me shedding power through the centuries. Yeah, that's really it's like a real bummer. Um, well, my 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 regular body lived a wonderful full life. That's, I mean, I guess yeah. that's, and now your consciousness is just in this weirdo ring oasis till you it's, run out I'm of- I'm more of a copy of my consciousness, really. I've, I've come to terms with that. Okay, I haven't quite come to terms with that, but that's a problem for another <laughs> time. Um, okay, so Gelly's gonna be like, got it. We gotta get the, the suit of armor from Branna's great, great, whatever it is, and, um maybe find one part of it that isn't ready and then we can shoot lightning bolts uh, am i missing anything i mean you'll you'll need all of the armor so. right, right right combine yeah. it all we've got yeah bits and pieces right now but not the you've whole got thing the thunder horn so once you bring that with the armor what happens be able when to we do the thunderbolts thing. when we put all the armor together do we become like a super crime fighter or what's the no it's just like the all the pieces of the armor they they complete a set and they work together to make the armor more powerful like how tall a person does it fit just out of curiosity oh they're it's magical so it just kind of likes to form fit whoever puts it on That's but handy. they have to be people we like it's a weird thing huh we Under being consent. like you and me or like you and your crew me and my crew it's sort okay. of like imbued with like our our judgment our, <laughs> our, uh, <laughs> our soul ish yeah yeah um don't got a real great word for it our chi i don't know ask Jush, Jush worked <laughs> they, they got the the this the, the vibe Taylee's um, into the spiritual thing, right? That's yeah. Taylee has lots of oils that I don't understand, um, and I'm they, I think, are magic. I'm not entirely sure if they're magic or if they're just really smelly. Uh, they could be both. Um, but this has been great. Um, but my been really internal clock sensor of danger tells me that there's not great stuff going on up above or down below or around wherever i don't know where this is i still know you said it's i don't get it um but somewhere else there's something bad happening and i feel like i need to go this is all happening in your head the, w w yeah this is where, in, where we're talking yeah. we're in my head in a manner of speaking yes were there you a ring in your head you're imagining this but it's being projected from the ring. It's magic. Umbero, it's... if if I wasn't finding the things you're telling me to find, I would think I was, I was, you know, not right. <laughs> I I can, you know, it's all coming together now. Why people think you're, uh -huh, yeah, the talking to myself <laughs> and talking to a man who only exists in my brain and is a copy of a person who maybe existed that I never met a thousand years ago. Well, when I'm you put fine. it all out like that, yeah. I'm so old. That's the only, I just, if this was when I was, you know, 27, I might've had a little more confidence in the old. I think a 27 year old halfling is like a baby. It is like a baby. <laughs> it's like a toddler. If I was a, a child, I would have believed this without a doubt, <laughs> but now I'm old. Okay. Um, I don't love that. You're telling me this is like an, in my brain situation. I thought we were literally going to like another pocket dimension. Um, no, it's just a projection from the ring into your head. Yeah. Okay. Cool. Cool. Yeah, but if you got, you know, an extended period of time when you're not worried about the outside, I got some druid stuff to teach you. But it sounds what? like you got something going on out there, so That's, you go do that first, I, and then we'll teach you to be more powerful. Okay, that, we should have been talking about that. All right. Okay. Oh, Umbero. yeah, I guess I suppose we should have done that instead of 
You think that'd be, if I'm going to be doing all of these like death defying challenges to get these things that maybe it could help if I knew some things that well, might be. Well, I sensed that you were finally ready to learn the things I'm about to teach you. You weren't really before. It might've made, you know, your head or the people around you's heads explode or turn into flowers. It depends. Druid stuff. Druid stuff. Okay. And she's going to take the ring off. <laughs> <laughs> And as you take the ring off, um, yeah, everyone's around you and your face is covered in eggs. Oh, God. <laughs> Back to the current. <laughs> so then yeah. I'm, I'm assuming Gelly just summarized that. Yeah. To the party. She just said all that okay. to you guys. I'm fine So with I look stealing. at the mushroom folks and I was like, so they were dating, right? <laughs> Oh, they absolutely. <laughs> yeah, they had to have been. Like, yeah. The number of times he mentioned shirtless and muscles, they were absolutely. Yeah, that was, there was like some, a. That explains why he was so angry in his younger years. You know, a lot of like emotions that he just wasn't dealing with. I think. Mm -hmm. All that sexual tension. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Kelly's just up. like. So that's that's the main thing you guys took away from that. <laughs> oh, also, that we might steal something, which I'm totally oh. fine with. Yeah. But yes. No. Mainly that. I think Umbero had some unresolved um, feelings. Feelings, yes. Yeah. Also, the See, fact I that you're kind of like doing drugs every time you put your ring on, Gelly. <laughs> I don't. I wouldn't yeah. say drugs. I'm going would on say... a trip. Well, <laughs> <laughs> I guess that's not entirely wrong. Man. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Well, so like, I guess we're gonna steal we're this suit. Like, anyway. Um. Yeah. That's, that's all crazy. Um, and Gara's like, hmm. So, hmm. so you have a person in your head? Well, I don't have a person in my head. I have a person in a ring that goes into my head. I think. And then the mushroom people are like, please don't cheat. We would also like to win the armor. But if you win it in a fair composition, that's cool too. Oh, I probably yes. shouldn't announce the like whole might have to steal a thing. In front of people. Uh, yeah. we, we, we would never in hindsight. Do that. <laughs> yeah, I was maybe a little too uh, open with the summary of events, but no, no, we wouldn't steal. We will fight. Gara Spake? and her team are like, oh, we don't really care about the armor. We're just like, we like cooking. That's us. Well, so maybe if also if you win, you just give us the armor. Oh no, it's really expensive looking. So. We'd make I a mean, lot of money if we sold it. We can give you something. We can give you money. I have money. <laughs> you guys remember, we whooped them before. Oh, <laughs> Verity wants to win a turn. <laughs> Actually, I want to... She's like, I want to steal. <laughs> I want to steal. <laughs> <laughs> You're the, the horse from over the garden. That's mm -hmm. a little yeah, that's what I was thinking about. <laughs> <laughs> um, but yeah, I, I think we could win. And uh, she just like winks at Gally. Wait, hold up. My eye was <laughs> Is she? Is it your yeah, wonky like... eye? <laughs> yeah, the one I just reattached. <laughs> You're like, it's a little <laughs> slow to recover. It's I'm getting there. Her hair's like <laughs> frazzled from like being beaten up. It's like blood in her eye that she's like... Oh, uh, Alec, I don't know if you know this, but I'm missing half my whiskers now from uh, the house incident. Oh. Oh, that's right. She's really yes. in rough shape. She looks <laughs> rough. Her balance yeah, is I... a little off. Do, Do any of us like, have we'll mending? We'll put some whisker grow on it. When we whisker <laughs> No. Oh, see what what you do, and Hagen will take some twigs and he'll like dip them in honey, and then just like <laughs> stick it on. Oh, it is new. When you do that, the mushrooms are like, yay, whiskers! <laughs> that's not that's not sheer. This <laughs> that's not swipes it off. <laughs> um, that's right. Yay! Accepting yourself for how you truly look. <laughs> Wow, that's very... Okay. This is a bit much even for Verity. That's so body positive. Oh my wow. goodness. I'm yeah, I guess very uncomfortable. You're a mushroom, you gotta be. <laughs> yeah, and these mushrooms are, their face are just, just just like covered in like ground beef grease because they've been just eating the whole time. 
uh, as Hobnob's been cooking all that meat for them. I guess it's not necessarily beef, ground meat of some kind. Yeah. Hobnob is watching them eat and is just thinking like stuffed mushrooms, stuffed mushrooms, uh, stuffed mushrooms, stuffed mushrooms. So good. Cook it again. <laughs> Um, okay. Do we know when the competition is? I can't remember. Would we have seen when it would be, Alec? I think it's in the morning. Uh, or, like, tomorrow, today. It's- the opening ceremonies are, 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 yeah, today, but, uh... It is, like, what, four in the morning right yeah. now? Oh, it's God! It's like in the middle of the night. <laughs> yeah. Nap time! Yeah. Okay. That's Very, what I've been yeah. saying! And he's like, okay, let's- let's head back to the house! Oh god, thank god. Uh, yeah, and, and just this giant group of people's heading over there. It's just like, are you all coming with us? Well, yeah, the... The town's that way. This is sort of the outskirts. Uh, I don't even oh. know who's talking right now. <laughs> Alec just said, do a funky voice. There's just so many noises in my head. <laughs> Someone's gotta sound like this. <laughs> NPCs with us right now. <laughs> yeah. Uh, yeah, you've got a dozen mushrooms um, and Gar's team, which is like three people. Yeah. That's a lot. Okay. Well. And then you guys. Everybody. We're going back to the to Verity's house. Caravan. Yeah. Yeah. Um, as you guys make it up the road, you're coming along the campsites where uh, various teams have set up. That are going to be competing and you see that uh two of them two of the teams have like they're all in like their not night outfits i guess like robes and whatever and they're uh, they seem to be having an argument and they're just like going at it with one another it's 4 a.m in the morning <laughs> <laughs> yeah I'm, <laughs> I'm perfectly okay with ignoring the situation <laughs> I almost and died today. I would like a nap. You did what? I almost. I went for a swim. Died. I need a shower. Mm hmm. Yeah. Can we hear any of the argument at all? Um. As we're walking by? Yeah. Okay. So, uh. You no. see that it's uh, a group of, like, bear people. And, um, they're going up against a group of what seems like beekeeper type folk. Oh, no. Hey, good. Uh, you you notice there are, like tools and stuff lying around their camp. They keep bees. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. They keep bees. And then <laughs> they're just accusing like the the bears like, hey, you guys, our our stores were just full of of just all types of honey right now, and it was obviously you who's taking it all. Oh, is it? Is it because we're bears we took all your honey? Oh god. We're oh, fine. Uh, you said that. <laughs> we didn't say that. Oh boy. Yeah, that seems like a problem for tomorrow. Oh definitely. <laughs> I'm surprised no one's like um, Hey it, it, it's 4 a.m. Uh you notice that some of those bees over there look very familiar to you. Huh? And um mm -hmm. they seem to be sampling bits of the honey my bees are thieving my bee <laughs> yeah my lady my bees? my <laughs> ladies my ladies up to no good girls you're supposed to wait for me to cast pass out a trace on you before you go stealing <laughs> stuff <laughs> uh, and then um as you're walking by um uh, hagen you do have your bee pack on you, and they do notice. the The beekeepers do seem to be starting to notice you. Do you have any sort of response, or like, do you try to do something? It, it's four a.m. Can you guys like keep it down? Okay, so you draw attention to yourself. <laughs> I mean, they're already looking at me, so <laughs> they weren't exactly going to. I was. I was gonna say, like, you- You're like, they're uh, starting mind. to notice you! So if they're making eye contact with me, hey, shut up, it's 4 a.m. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. I guess you could've, like, like, tried to hide or something. I don't know, whatever. <laughs> it's D&D, you do what you want. We choose violence. <laughs> I, I choose to say, shut up, it's 4 a.m. 
Like, there, there's a competition, there's a festival in the morning, everyone else is trying to sleep. Like, be quiet. Huh, be quiet. <laughs> <laughs> we can't They're bear like... this anymore. <laughs> <laughs> That's good. Hey. Uh, yeah. They're like, hey! It's like, sorry, sorry, where? And then they, they look at, like, the bees that are hovering around your, be your like, box, and they're like, hold on a second. Because, <laughs> you know, they're beekeepers. They know how the their bees look like. Yeah, and they're like, better. are these your bees? Who can say? A bee's a bee, you know? She's her own bee. That's not true. Yeah, they are their own bees. They go where they will. Um, Who can really claim ownership of a bee? The beekeeper that is nature. like accusing you, they snap their fingers and all of their bees like zip back into the hive that Ooh. they're from. So and just like your bees are, are there. And they've just got like gobs of honey in their hands. Their little bee hands. And their little bee hands. <laughs> As I say, bees will go where they will. Bees are bees. Eh. Not food. BRB will handle ah. us in the morning? Yes, we exactly. <laughs> needed that honey for the competition. And now you owe us some honey. Um, sure, and he'll take a jar out of his thing and just like toss it over. It's really good. You're honey. lucky. That's really good. Yep. I High sell that stuff the best. Price. Top dollar. Well, we're not paying you for this. Well, that's. You, you're not. I gave it to you. <laughs> <laughs> you're right. Don't know why I'm arguing. Thank you. Yeah. You're welcome. Good night. Be quiet. Uh... All right. Hey, <laughs> 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 uh, Hagen. Be Hagen. <laughs> Wow, that situation was handed much more diplomatically than I thought. <laughs> I mean, you want me to shoot them in the morning? I can shoot them. I can do some <laughs> cool elf us, shit. If you want us to like rough up some innocent bystanders, can you wait until the morning to get <laughs> I am dying. Verity almost died. <laughs> I need I need to come up with better encounters. I'm no, it's a good encounter. No, it's, it's a real encounter. I am near death. If you had prompted that in the morning after they'd all slept, they'd have been like, let go of those bees. <laughs> we'll F you up. We're going to save every last bee in your uh, entire colony. But now we're like, we need sleep. The bees yeah. will be fine. Like, Come on, I girls. I am one encounter away from death again. I need to rest. Okay. Come on, girls. <laughs> you guys uh, make it up to the house, and um, the, the the mushrooms are all like, thanks for saving us! And you see that a bunch of the mushrooms have honey with them as they're walking away. I don't care. <laughs> <laughs> That's a problem. For someone else, not for well, us. They are grown mushrooms, and those beekeepers are grown beekeepers. They can hash it out themselves. We're not the ones being paid to keep the peace. <laughs> That's very true. Um, uh, and Gara's like, but sorry, sorry again. Sorry, just... we'll make it up to you guys later. Make what up, make what up to us. You. Oh yeah, you could if you win, give us the armor since you did almost kill one of us. Maybe you almost that. killed mm -hmm. one of us? Okay, bye! Yeah, that's what I thought. <laughs> See you later! She'll give us the armor. <laughs> she better. I'll make sure of it. <laughs> how, many times, how many times have we gone out on a limb for her? More than is At reasonable. least five times the first time we met. So. Yeah, yep. mm -hmm. far more than is reasonable. You have any idea how much my family charges for stuff like that? Mm -mm. <laughs> yeah, something... she's going to give us that armor. <laughs> There's something weird about her. Like, did y'all get a weird vibe just now? Well, um, definitely when I was punched just and now? almost near death. <laughs> what? So... You were punched and near death? It's an exaggeration, Gilly. I don't get with the times. Uh, she seemed to like, <laughs> really... It's an old, it's an old elvish saying. <laughs> She's I don't think it is. Things. I've been around longer still... than Verity has, and I think I'd know that phrase. <laughs> elvish. She was so <laughs> interested Gilly. in... She was so interested in death, the... then. What? 
<laughs> What's a dab then, Kelly? A dab oh. is a type of fish. Exactly. <laughs> she says with total seriousness. <laughs> She's not wrong. Oh, you think I'm dumb? I know it's a fish. I don't know what kind of joke you're trying to play, but I know what a fish is. <laughs> Kelly, Kelly. Hmm. I, I caught my first fish today. Your first fish? Yeah. Really? I let it go. I let it go. It was about this big. Oh. I never caught one before. That's a good size to catch. Thanks. I'm very proud of you. On the subject of fish, I just thought. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Wait, I'm, you're I'm distracting me. <laughs> Verity has run off. I tried, Verity. <laughs> go, kid, go. Why, I got Verity, can, you can, and can... Kelly stay in the same room. <laughs> she just runs to the room and Kelly's like, <laughs> uh, hello. When she gets there, she's like, <laughs> Actually, Verity wants to take a shower. She's a little gross and did swim in a queso, <laughs> queso lake pool. There was it wasn't filled with cheese. It's just it was a regular lake. Cheese comes rises to the surface. Oh, yeah, that's wax. so gross. It's sealed in wax. It's fine, Galley. It's fine. A lake I'm, I'm... that has cheese rising to the surface? <laughs> cheese that has been in there for generations. That is horrific. I should probably also re-shower. <laughs> I'm just saying, yeah. aged cheese is great. Not watery Not for bathing. Cheese. Not for bathing. Not for bathing. In. No, that's true. It's good for the skin. Yeah, what? I... I love looking unkempt. It's sort of like a middle finger to my family. I do draw the line at bathing in cheese. <laughs> yeah. yeah. All right. I didn't even so, have cheese therapy. That's, that's a long rest for everybody. Oh, Whoa! thank God. Oh, my God. Oh, Finally. my God. Our third one in a campaign that's lasted over a year. <laughs> like almost 50 episodes. <laughs> Oh I love pushing that button so much. Oh my I god! Know. Me so too. nice. It feels See, so good. I, I make I make people appreciate their. It's long true. Rests. I have a very strong appreciation <laughs> for long rests now. Um, I just want to say, after my shower, I dried myself using towels that were embroidered with the name Justice on them. Just throwing that out there. Okay. And Justice. And I made like, sure. Has anyone seen my towels? <laughs> I it's, had them on the rack, but they seem a, to be it's missing. 5 a.m. Oh my god. Go to bed. I'm using this to dry off my feet. <laughs> okay, so uh, I guess Hagen is the first one that like is up and about because you only Makes sense. meditate for four hours. Yep. <laughs> so you're up at about like nine. <sighs> Everyone's uh, getting ready for breakfast, and uh, you see um, Gara's there at the breakfast table. And she's like, oh, hey, Hagen. Oh, hey, I didn't know you were staying here, too. Oh, I'm not. I came to try and uh, apologize for yesterday. Ah, well, uh, I'm pretty sure Verity's still sleeping. They need a couple more hours. Oh. Well, um, how about... You and I just hang out then, huh? Okay, but, uh... <laughs> there's any scuffle, you get the hell out of here. <laughs> uh, hmm? I know how to handle myself. I can help. Ish. <laughs> Define I, help! <laughs> I can, like, call out, like, things that are happening. You know, let you know the lay of the land. As long as you stay, like, ten feet back. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, as long as we don't run into any, like, rogue cheese or anything like that. Ugh, yeah. Ooh. That's weird. Yeah. Um. But anyway, I don't know, I was just, like, wondering how such a an interesting bunch of folks like you and your friends would, like, all come to meet. You're, um, you're an odd bunch, you know? I mean, Haley and I met at a bar. And, uh, Gelly and Verdi were already hanging out and just sort of, you know. Oh, well, I uh, guess that's I don't know. a lot simpler than I thought it was. So you're just, yeah. just a group of folks, huh? Nothing 
Nothing crazy about that. Nah. Just people who came to travel together and then got into trouble together, got out of trouble together, and uh, you do that enough times and you start liking each other, I guess. Yeah, I can see that. And it's just usually not an elf, a halfling, a human, and a mouse folk. Yeah, not a bunch, but uh, what's the phrase? I don't know, something about, I don't know, adversity brings people together. I don't, I don't know, one of those sayings they drill into you so, in school that- So you all just really just fell together and then happen to have all these really like crazy powers I've seen you use. I haven't seen really anybody like you guys. I mean, again, in enough adversity, you get pretty good at fighting back. <laughs> that or die, so... <laughs> I guess so. <laughs> Trouble Oof. just seems to follow you around. Does it feel like that? I feel like that since I've been hanging out with you guys. I mean... <laughs> to be fair, you got attacked by the cheese before we came up. But... That's yeah, no, true. No, apparently that stuff doesn't happen around here, according to Verbena, so... It does no. seem like trouble followed. <laughs> I, I can say... Yeah, I don't think I've been in as much mortal danger in the last... Ye several years of my life than these I couple mean, days I've spent around you guys. I mean, the lake one, you did sort of... We did tell you to stay back, and you just sort of dove in anyway, so... Oh, that's... I don't think that one's on us. That's... yeah. Uh... And you did keep running back towards the cheese, so, like, maybe Trouble's following us, but help. it seems like you're following us, too. <laughs> <laughs> what? No. Um, I'm just... I'm just... you guys are just interesting, is all. And, Thank you. And, you know, you're all really well, cool. What, what, what about you? Uh, like you're interesting. <laughs> Oh. What's your story? Uh. Uh, well. It's kind of embarrassing. Uh, I'm just a. Not, not nearly as interesting as you. I'm just a little girl from a. From a seaside town, and. We just. Thought we'd try and be at this competition. Get the name out, you know? Of our <sighs> place. That's what is all. your place? It's, uh. Seaportville? Seaportville? Yeah. That is a name. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, good old wanna... Seaportville. <laughs> born and raised. This one ended up Alec, we do respect you and like you, okay? <laughs> 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 <That is nice>. <laughs> <laughs> yes. <laughs> I just need to really everything that you say to us. <laughs> Oh, there's a whole bunch of Discord messages. Oh, goodness. Oh, you're fine, uh, you're fine. Oh, uh, I was uh, saying, I was saying. It's that... mid-break time. Hey, this is just the middle of roll initiative. <laughs> oh, they're like, take a mid like, eating breakfast, right. like, yep. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. Oh, my goodness. Do you know, I was saying in the chat, uh, do you know the audio I'm talking about on TikTok that's like, I want to be a modern dancer. What a super weird thing to say that came out, <laughs> came of, out nowhere. of nowhere. <laughs> <laughs> that is the energy of this of that conversation. It's <laughs> so good. I just want Hayden just that. like loudly and awkwardly <laughs> sipping tea. Like, this is a weird. <laughs> I love it. I love it. You know, I just felt bad because Alex had like this great interaction and they were like, no, fuck you. Let's go rest. <laughs> and then he's like, oh, you know, Seaportville. And we're like, okay. <laughs> Alec, we love we you. Love we yes, I adore you. you. <laughs> Your games are so fun. I enjoy them so much. Mm -hmm. Hagen's just an asshole. Hagen's just giving everybody a hard time. Stephanie is an asshole as well, so I do. Uh, uh, it's fine. I <laughs> Hagen is 234 years old. He has made three friends in his lifetime, so yeah, he's working on it. <laughs> I hope oh, everyone in the comments these t for this pre-recording is is having a good time. Yes, uh, especially yes. you over there, call uh, um person whose color is green. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> we're talking to and you. And also the the red color names too. <laughs> I would change my color right now. <laughs> <laughs>
But those blue color folk, oh, you guys can have, you guys are uh, having a great time too, I hope. Anyway. All right. We do have a couple words. We got words from Emily. <laughs> are you guys using incognito mode on your browser to hide your activity? If you are, we've got some bad news for you. It doesn't matter what mode you use or how many times you clear your browser history, your ISP can still see every website you visit. Yes. Even those dwarven fanfics you've been looking at. <laughs> So, ExpressVPN what? is an app. Huh? Go ahead. I said, what? <laughs> My dwarven fanfics. Even the dwarven fanfics. We're looking at you, Umbero. ExpressVPN <laughs> is an app that reroutes and encrypts your internet connection through their secure servers so your internet provider can't see the sites you visit. Go to expressvpn.com slash RTTV today to find out how you can get an extra three months of ExpressVPN for free. So that's expressvpn.com slash RTTV. Protect your data today with ExpressVPN. Looking at you, Umbero. I love, I love that. I love everything about that, Emily. <laughs> that was great. I had to call Umbero is very interested in ExpressVPN. Umbero's <laughs> looking it up for right now. Umbero, signing up. On his, his desert oasis, like, oh. Druid computer. He's like, Gally's on to me. Do you think he gets, does he have internet out there? He has he does, magic right? internet. Magic, <laughs> magical net. Magic internet. <laughs> oh man! Oh goodness! Okay. Ooh, what a Sorry, ride this didn't has been. mean to interrupt the beautiful conversation between Hagen and uh, Gara. <laughs> what a super weird thing to say that came out of nowhere. <laughs> <laughs> I've never felt it was the. I've never felt more like I'm in mortal danger than with you guys. Oh. <laughs> okay. <laughs> um. I'm a little insulted. <laughs> From Seaportville. Where is Seaportville? <laughs> that is yeah, a town. You know, um... Seaportville. It's, it's a town. It is a town. <laughs> Next to the sea. Is it a town, though? Hang By it. the sea. Why isn't she sleeping? No, I... I know. Why aren't you... Do you need sleep? Oh, are we back into the show? We yeah. are. <laughs> no, no, sorry, the party just strong armed our way back into RP. <laughs> I thought yeah. we were just chatting. I'm sorry. No, we were all like, how and long now have we been rolling? We're, been role we're play. back in it. Now. I want D and D, <laughs> and I want it now. Uh, Hagen kicks down a door. I've never been to the ocean. <laughs> <laughs> um. Yeah. Uh. Cat, yeah. Hey, welcome back to the show Wait, uh, we've, <laughs> that we've been to. Gara, are you okay? This is great. Gara. <laughs> Gara's like, oh, <laughs> you darn. <laughs> you guys. This is what happens You're when I've so been away amazing. for a week. I just uh, feel so like loopy right now. I'm loving it. How, how, who, who does Taylee's hair? Mine's always just like everywhere. Is Gara asking this? Yeah, Gara's he, asking Hagen, like, who does you need? Do you need some help with it? I mean, I know it doesn't look like much, but I, I used to have a lot of hair. Oh, uh, yeah. I mean, if, if that's okay with you, I don't want to I don't mind. Impose. I mean, elves, we do a lot of hair braiding. It's sort of second nature. Okay, uh, yeah, if you want to make, like, a sleight of hand check. All right. Do, do something mm. cool with Gara's Pull up hair. my stats. <laughs> um, dirty 21. Ooh. 14 <laughs> plus 7. <laughs> Dang. Get sweet braids. Give her a yeah. Yeah. real good hair. Uh, <laughs> sorry, what, what, what was that again? 21. 21, oh damn. Yeah, uh, go ahead and describe what you've made Gara's hair look like now, I guess. It's... You know, a bunch of smaller braids, and they're sort of like woven together really intricately. And he's even like plucking flowers from his hat, and like, girls, oh. girls, and they bring some other stuff. And he's just like, he pulls out like a little bit of golden wire and uses it to wrap up the end. And it's been a while, but not too bad. What do you think? She's like tearing up. She's oh. like, that's, that's really, it's really cute. Oh my God. Glad you like it. Yes. Uh, I, uh, 
Yeah, Are you okay? okay? It's cool. It's cool. Uh, you, you, I, I guess it's cool. I mean, I mean, it is cool. It is cool. I love. I love it. Thanks. Sorry, right. I hang out with a seagull and a manta ray. <laughs> and, you know, they, they don't usually talk about hair too much. And uh, uh, just been elves. A... It's like twenty-five percent of the conversation half the time. Really? Yes. <laughs> Yeah, That's after a hundred years or so, you get sick of it. <laughs> but, uh... <laughs> yeah. No problem. Um... Boy! Huh! Yeah! Oh, boy! Uh, anyway... Yeah, that's... Cool. Everyone else wakes up. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. Uh, yeah. Do you guys uh... head to the kitchen, or, um... Yeah. Well, um, Gelly's gonna you, first you, thing Gelly does when she wakes up is she's to gonna like stand over Verity and like inspect to see if all of her wounds are healing or not. <laughs> you you see that like uh, Verity's whiskers have started growing back. Okay. But, but like, just imagine like uh, you know how we wear a face mask. Imagine there's like one from like mice, like an overnight <laughs> one. That's what she's wearing for like. <laughs> Cute. <laughs> kind of. <laughs> gotta keep up her little whiskers. Okay. Uh, you do notice that she's got, like, a bunch of, like, uh, seaweed stuff on, like, her gear that's to the side. Not seaweed stuff, I guess vines. Oh, from, like, the lily pads? Yeah, from the lily pads. Deli's gonna go over and try to clean it up. Aww. <gasps> Pancake dog. Bobby <Bobby's> dog. <gasps> Did you guys like some pancakes? Yes, <laughs> it is breakfast time finally. <laughs> yeah, it's so great that the pancake dog made his way all the way to Middle Hey, he wanted to join the cooking competition. <laughs> oh, yeah, oh makes sense gosh. actually. Yeah. <laughs> There's a whole like pancake dog team. He's really clingy, isn't he? <laughs> we I really want to make I want the show to be big just so I can get approved for like adventures a of pancake stock. dog. Yes. Yeah, it's like the cabbage guy in, in Avatar. <laughs> no, I really do want to write small, wholesome, tall tales for small folk. I really want to write it. <laughs> yes, <laughs> make like a children's book or something. Okay, anyway, sorry. Yeah, uh, seaweed right. on yeah. stuff. Clean it. Cleaning it. Cleaning it. Okay. Before, uh, before actually, you make a sleight of hand check to see how good you are at cleaning things. Hmm. Interesting. Where is I don't even. Oh, okay. Not terrible at that. Oh wow, dirty twenty. Oh my, Ooh, very ooh, clean. Yeah. Nice. <laughs> it's like it's. She yeah, uses yeah, like druid some, like... craft, even though she doesn't have it, but yeah. like druid craft to like pull the vines away. Yeah. Um. With that excellent roll, you know that um, these are like. Uh, it, evil murdery vines? vines i guess like vines that uh uh on you've know you know from like your druiding mm -hmm. that these vines are like aggressive vines that usually attack things gelly's gonna be like standing over verity holding them up going these are murder vines <laughs> <laughs> good morning <laughs> she wakes up morning <laughs> morning Murder vines. <laughs> you say the darndest things. <laughs> you say the darndest. Wait, wait, wait! I want to do something. I want to do something. She rolls her size and picks it up. Say hello, cider. Ah! It's Hi. early in the morning. God, it's horrible. Good morning, Gally. <laughs> Where's Hobnob? You just hear like cussing coming from the kitchen. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, it's really it's I fascinating. Cook, I cook, I cook, no one else. I cook, no one. Get out. Get out. It's like cider and hobnob have equal but separate chaotic energy. <laughs> yes. <laughs> yes. Oh, gosh. Like, yes. Um, all the all the Rizzo family are just like laughing at like the. I guess it's the Riz the Rizzo servants who are just like we 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 just can't get in there. Uh, it just keeps co keeps cooking everything, and then um, there's like pots and pans being thrown. Yeah. Out. He's like, "Useless, useless! You're all useless, useless, useless!" useless. useless. <laughs> just throwing the pans. Like, I'm the better pan, ultimate pan. 
Uh, all the, I'm assuming all the sisters love it. Yeah. <laughs> Except one. Justice, yeah, I'm sure it's just like, this is, <laughs> this is just so uncouth. I don't, I don't like it. <laughs> who brought, who brought the magic frying pan? Did we buy that? Was it expensive? Can we return buy that, it? Buy that? You couldn't afford! You couldn't afford! <laughs> <laughs> useless! Oh. Useless! <laughs> yeah, please, Be careful, Justice! It? He might touch you with his grimy hands! <laughs> I am pristine. <laughs> <laughs> You're the most pristinest of pristines, Hobnob. <laughs> um, and then yeah you see your parents coming in the room for breakfast and they're like oh 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 hey fairy how was how was your day yesterday i did That's a lot dad. of writing mom and pop so much writing oh that sounds lovely <laughs> yeah Okay, well, I'm gonna go that way. <laughs> she just kind of like tries to hide. Oh man! And then her wait, wait, wait like... actually, no. <laughs> Sorry, turn it back around. Uh, does anyone know about the evil, weird things that have been happening in town lately? Yeah, yeah. Like all the sisters and everyone, like, oh yeah, that's really weird that all that stuff's been happening. Usually, it's just like a peaceful, idyllic countryside out here. Yeah, how, how long has that been going on? Oh, uh, since you guys showed up. No, that's... No. Ah, like, you know, sometimes, you know, a wagon wheel will break. And... I mean, you mentioned oh, that the God. cheese thing had already been an issue because your family was developing it. Yeah, but... what about that queso light? Yeah, but that's the... Uh, that stuff's, like, usually out there. No one ever, like, seeks out, like, danger. <sighs> Actually, um, Hagen, I want to apologize for every mean thought that I've had about you and your brother. <laughs> Thank you. You're welcome. <laughs> he is great, you didn't by the ask way. Ask them about the house. Uh, do you uh, know about any uh, houses that like to eat people? No, no, no. We're we're just here. We make cheese. And Verbena's like I. I don't do the cheese thing. I'm the florist. Yes, yes, Verbena, we know. Do you guys know somebody named, like, Peter? And he's friends? He's like, there's a Diddy, and... There's there's a lot of others. new weird people in town right now. Yeah, a lot of new weird people. Because hmm. that could bring trouble. Hmm. Yeah, maybe that's it. Maybe it's the town festival thing. Well... Hmm. And then Justice is like, well, no... Things were pretty okay with everybody starting to show up, and then, yeah. No, no. So what? It's been a rise so you, in odd so, cases. So you're blaming us, Justice? No, no. Correlation does not equal causation. That's but what I thought. Very, you, you are, you are, just, just oh, objectively what? speaking. What, to Justice? Trouble, known to cause a little bit of a stir. I don't know what you're talking about. She smacks a cup off the table <laughs> and then picks it right back and puts it on the table. <laughs> <laughs> the maids come over and they like mop up that spill. You no, no, I'm made. sorry. I'm sorry. It was my fault. My fault. <laughs> she like elbows up. I imagine girls doing it girls just like a cat. <laughs> they like make eye contact with you and they're just like. <laughs> <laughs> and, then, and then uh Justice is like, Freddy, stop, stop. We pay them for a reason. Oh my god, Justice! Oh, she's one of those. Yeah, she's a really bad tipper, too. <laughs> uh, Justice, Let's it seems in. like I shouldn't have been kidnapped by my sister and brought back. It seems I... like somebody shouldn't have kidnapped herself out into the scary wilderness where all these bad things happen in the first place. You can't but... kidnap yourself! Also, she was doing fine out there. Hey, at least she didn't blame Gelly this time. Progress. That's true. That's true. Progress. Again, we're sorry, Gelly. We've mm -hmm. developed this really weird hatred towards you, but it's all gone now. Uh, I really feel like I was just justice. 
<laughs> no one else seems to have minds. I mean, that's yeah. fine. A lot of people hate me. I've kind of come to terms with that. I don't hate you, Gally. You're the bestest in the world. Yeah. Uh, you're all pretty biased, but I appreciate that. Extremely biased, and I stand by that. <laughs> so cute. <laughs> Um, Kelly's yeah, like, then... you have no idea the enemies that I have. <laughs> <laughs> and then Garl's like, so you guys do get into trouble a lot? Man, or... what's a lot, you no. know? No, 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 no. Marty's like, family's what? still around? No. <laughs> <laughs> no. It's like an average this, amount. She's like, what's this book you're writing? It's tall tales for small folk. Short folk. <laughs> small, <laughs> short folk. Short folk. I said it <laughs> before. It's a very, uh, we've, we've already gotten the advance on it. So we really have to deliver. Mm-hmm. Yeah. <laughs> Justice is like, why don't you give me a sample of one of the passages from this book? You can buy it when it comes out, Justice. Uh, Daisy and Daffodil are like, we want to know. Tell us one story. <laughs> I mean, we already gave you some summaries yesterday. Mm -hmm. Yep. Mm -hmm. Was that yesterday? Remember? The day before Tell yesterday? Tell us another one. Another one. Well, uh, we were asking about... Tell us about the motorcycles. Motorcycles? Well... Uh, Verity was you know... bragging about a motorcycle. Barity was bragging uh, about a motorcycle. Uh, on one wheel. She uh, she glares at uh, Daisy and Daffodil. He was like, I told you not to bring up anything I told you about the book. We know. <laughs> we chose to do I, it anyway. <laughs> I, I look at them. I'm going to hug you. Hug you so tight after breakfast. <laughs> Aren't siblings if, the worst? If you guys haven't picked I'm up so on glad I only Daisy have and one. Daffodil are the troublemakers. Yeah. Cute. But not like, like the Verity troublemaking. Haley, how many but they're very limber. And they're, <laughs> they, they are very limber. They they took Taylor's uh, yoga class and That's true. class passed with flying colors. Haley, how many siblings do you have? Um, we're not talking about that right now. <laughs> That's a totally normal answer to that question. Okay. <laughs> We've only been I traveling together for all one. this time. One? Oh. one? One is a good number. I have one. one. One would be a great number. The only one better than one is I none. I do. Uh, I have a younger brother. Oh. A brother? Mm-hmm. His name is yeah. Kyle. Daffodil. Kyle? Oh, man, cute. Kyle? <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, I just I thought with a name like Haley, he would have a... <laughs> the first name that popped into my brain. <laughs> And now you know why that town is named Seaportville. Yep. <laughs> but there's a there's a theme here. Watch out, everybody! Haven't... Kyle's coming. There's a theme if you haven't noticed it yet. <laughs> the great mystical, powerful Kyle. <laughs> oh man. Maybe maybe his name changes. I don't know. Maybe Kyle's maybe lying. Name. Maybe Taylor's lying. Yeah. Maybe Kyle's maybe a that nickname. Too. Mm -hmm. Yeah, maybe Taylor's. I'm sorry. Lying. I'm so sorry, Emily. I just. <laughs> Ah, yes, Kyle, the nickname for Lysander or something else. <laughs> Kyle, short so, for Ganondorf. Exactly. Any, any, any Kyle out there, I do apologize. It's a great it name. So it was just so surprising. It was the not what we were folks expecting. The name was Peter, Steph. That yeah, true. that's fine. But for, like, he, Taylor's brother. That's. I would have thought it would have been something, uh, yeah. It's like, Kyle with like three wives. <laughs> Peter was Peter because he was a wolf. It was a joke. <laughs> okay, Kyle with three wives. How about that? Okay, I'm sorry. sorry, sorry, sorry. <laughs> Kyle has three wives? Kyle. Oh, Kyle with three wives. I heard yeah. that. Name oh, pending. Yeah. <laughs> Name pending. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Em. Yeah. All right, Taylor, so I get shocking. it. You don't want to talk about it. <laughs> You don't have to tell me his name, it's okay. Hannah's already <laughs> put it in the NPC catalog. 
I'm just stressing <laughs> out mean? variations of spelling. It's like Star Wars, where it's like a name that is very normal, but they put an apostrophe in it somewhere to make yeah. it seem K Y apostrophe Y L E. <laughs> oh, you know, Kyle. Kyle. I love it. Um, it's it's okay, Taylor. Trust me, I. Anyone can understand sore subjects with family. <laughs> This guy. Okay. More tea. <laughs> At a more appropriate time. Yes, of course. <laughs> yeah. You betcha. Yep. Gara's like, I don't have any siblings, but I have 17 cousins and they're a handful. They're basically my siblings. Oh man, don't get That's me started on the cousins. Oh goodness. You think I this is a lot? Think about that. <laughs> I don't want to know how many cousins you have. <laughs> I lose count. There's just litters yes. of them. I have some, We're, but we don't really... This is... <laughs> Sorry. We have a small family. <laughs> I was just about to say that. I was like, we have a small... Ours is the smallest of the clan. I can't imagine what reunions are like. <laughs> Messy! <laughs> Duo's like, a lot of cheese. <laughs> <laughs> Yep. Well, it's, uh, <laughs> when's the opening <clears throat> ceremony? Oh, yeah. Oh, that happened this morning. You guys were asleep. What? Yeah, oh. it happens at, like, 7 a.m. Oh, God. Okay, but the when competition the hasn't started, comes. right? No, no, no. Okay. But, yeah, there, there was a parade. I'm surprised you guys didn't wake up. <gasps> we missed a parade? Oh, my God, I love parades. That's a bummer. Oh, that was the first parade. parade. Don't worry, there's gonna be parades the whole time. <gasps> oh People my God. like doing okay, parades. Good. It's a nice. Good. I want to see a parade. Yeah, when we held this competition in Seaportville, it was it was wild. There were boats in that one, though. Oops. Uh, we lost an accident. Yep, was channels. Audio. That that oh, was there. We that go. Was an accident. There he is. Let's let's cut this for the live bit. <laughs> I don't know how I I don't know how I keep this together. Anyway, yeah. Sorry, I'm I, I've lost all my pages. You're good. Um, there's multiple parades. Yes, there's multiple we're parades good. throughout the day. Mm -hmm. Opening ceremonies already happened this morning, so we're good there. Yeah. We missed um, out, but that's okay. Gara's like, so, um, you guys are competing, right? What, what teams are you gonna be in? Uh, I and then Justice I is like, of just course, Verity will be with us. <laughs> uh, she looks at Justice, and like threatens to like hit the cup again. I don't think so, but. Well, I mean, and if 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 we had multiple, like, oh, excuse me, how how would you not be joining the family? Kelly's gonna uh... and Verbena's like, well, d don't worry, Justice. She can like, no, this is not proper. She's the just gonna so good stick together. Your face isn't proper. Well, <laughs> how, how dare you? Like, she like starts like touching her face and like, there's some... no, no, of course, there's nothing wrong with my face. Yeah, it is. Your face is wrong. <laughs> Verity? Verity, this is... This, the competition has come to this town for the first time, and you will be in the Rizzo team. Oh. Oh my god. Justice? Justice! What? Like, right right here. Where? Right here. Where? Right here. Make a deception. <laughs> Check. <laughs> I hope this works. Nine? Oh. Wait, I want to use my inspiration. <laughs> <laughs> this is important. <laughs> Hell yeah, that is... Where the fuck are you? Sorry, I was the F-bomb. Uh, 18. Oh, yep. You this win. is a wholesome stream, <laughs> Steffi. Sorry. Sorry. Okay, uh, how do you deceive um, 
Justice. So I, I just start acting. So I was like, oh my god, Justice, you're fi- right, he- right here. Oh my god, you got it. Smack at it. Smack at it. There's something on your face. She's just like, ah, ah, what is it? Is it a spider? <laughs> it's just ah. your ugly mug. <laughs> got you. Dead. Verity, that <laughs> that is not. And then you, even, Verity, you even see your mom and your dad like going. Like, <laughs> <laughs> Haley Not leans over can. to Ga- Gelly and Hagen, and she's like, "It's so fun to see like Verity so naughty with her sisters." Wow. <laughs> I'm, I've she's never res- like this. <laughs> I've really grown to respect her these last few days. Right? <laughs> kind of weird. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> Don't get used to this. <laughs> I mean, it will up our chances if we're on multiple teams, but. <laughs> uh, hmm. Hey, fam, if you win, can you give me the armor for research? Verity Slick. Uh, uh, Verity. Uh, Justice Slick? No, of course not. You're not the it team captain. It will go into the family's coffers. Your butt needs to go in the coffers. <laughs> That's. That's so old. Your so butt. Use it all the time. Your butt. Your butt. What is this? The nineties. Your butt. This is as mean as Verity gets. Okay. I love this respect. Wait, who's the team captain of uh, the Rizzo family? It's Verbena. Uh. Then it's up to Verbena. She uh, knows why we need it. She was there. I, it's true. I yeah, they I suppose they they do need it, Justice. We are not going to give you that armor. Alright. That's <laughs> We it's not up to a oh, we, it's up to Verbeen. It is not up to Verbeen. <laughs> Verbeen, I love that. <laughs> it is up to the household. Hey, Mom, Pop, can I have the armor if you win it? Oh, um, we don't manage expenses anymore. We're we've retired. Mom, Pop. Yeah, we we always want to give you everything, honey. You can take, you know. Your, your gold that we've put aside for you and you can buy your own set of armor but I want that one. <laughs> oh my god you can't buy that one it's a <gasps> it's a victory thing dear from the family <laughs> if the family wins <laughs> oh goodness oh here comes the waterworks <laughs> oh I, I can't fake cry. It's really hard. <laughs> <laughs> Justice just right. like slams her hand down on the table. Yeah, I don't want to like ruin the recording. So just like <laughs> 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 that, but like way louder. <laughs> She's like, all right, Verity, you think you're so ready to be good about this? How about you go ahead and Start up your own team, and if you win that armor, you, the armor is yours, and you can go and do and go out and do whatever you want. All right, um, you won't listen to reason. How about that? I thought her name was. She Justice. looks at like her. <laughs> she looks at the others, and I'm like, that that was the plan. So, good yeah, job. Yeah, well, fine. Up a... Good. <laughs> Justice was saying this. Did I did I say a different mouse was saying this? <laughs> Which mouse did it's, I say? There's I don't so many I don't remember, but carry I'm on. Sure it was justice. Just justice. Okay, yeah, Justice is saying all that. Okay, Justice, that's that was that was literally the plan. So, uh, <laughs> spat my tea a little bit. <laughs> I've Sorry. learned to just cover mine sometimes. <laughs> I should have done that. Uh, and then Verbena goes like, oh. Okay, uh, guess we'll have to replace Verity on the team. Um, Daffodil, you wanna? It's like, yeah, we'll do And then Justice is like, no, I will be joining the team. We weren't even on the team? No, I'm, I'm doing a lot managing whatever is happening right now. You know, there's a whole festival happening. 
sorry, and you know, we're a very prominent family in the community. I don't know if you've heard, Verity. We've got a lot of responsibilities in this town to keep up. And then you should be protecting the community instead of letting evil houses attack the, like random villagers and guests. That's never happened. Mm -hmm. That's not the point. New things happen all the time. You're all high and mighty. Gotta protect the like, family. Gotta become a knight. Gotta abandon your little sister. It's the you know, for what? If we're not gonna mm. protect us, then I Some am night protecting us. About Nothing's happened in this town. I was literally I attacked by a house. The border I was safe. literally attacked by evil lily pads, little mushrooms that are really cute, by the way. Were attacked by evil lilies. There was a wolf in sheep's clothing. I think that was the metaphor. Honestly, a lot was happening. And then there's evil cheese rolls trying to eat people up. That's a lot to happen in two days. Gelly's gonna, is, under her breath, just be like, you. I told you it was murder vines. This is all of you. <laughs> you and your weird friends have brought all of this evil to this town. It was a nice, quiet place until all of you and your crazy friends showed up. We really need to stop this, all right? Wait, 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 you brought us here. You brought us here. You kidnapped us. Because you kidnapped really, my sister. Okay, she kidnapped herself. Either way, not how she that can't works. keep <laughs> doing this with you guys, because obviously it's bringing evilness to the town. It's bringing hardship here, and it's just, it's so much on all of us. All of us? You're not the one doing anything. My friends are the one protecting everybody from, like, your mess. We've saved it's not you guys, my like, mess. three times. You brought the mess. No, the mess was here. What we got here? No one else has been attacked by giant cheese wheels. There haven't been giant attacking evil houses. Wait, wait, wait. Obviously, no, 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 no. You lot we have told, brought it here. We were told that the evil cheese wheels were happening before we got here. Mm -hmm. Yeah, your family made them. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but they haven't been attacking people. My troops Which... have been keeping them at bay. Sounds so like that seems like a you problem. Troops. Yeah, it seems like yeah. you're doing your job poorly. Yeah. <laughs> For once, on Gelly you. is you the failed. one who's actually being bought into this and is like, am I the problem? <laughs> Gelly's like, I baddies? kidnapped. Danger? Are we the villains? <laughs> Gelly's like, I kidnapped Verity. I came back and all this horrible stuff happened. I mean, the math is adding up. She's like sitting there talking to herself. <laughs> and getting increasingly more worried. I mean, we can leave once we have the armor. Yes, I'd like you to leave, but Verity has to stay. Nope. I think nope. that's up to Verity. And she's, I want to go. She's her she's own a, agent. She's a she's grown an woman. Adult. So, well, I don't know that she's... That's... Yeah, no, I, I am. Oh. Well, We're adults at, like, five. And I'm six and a half. How about this, then? You win, You guys win. You do whatever you want. Whatever. I don't think you're gonna win. You're... You're all too... Crazy to be able to, to coordinate yourself enough to win this competition. But if I win... You know what? I'll give you the armor. I'll say, yeah, I'll give you the armor. You can take it. Do whatever you want with it. But then Verity has to stay here. And that's if I win. <laughs> Verity leads to whoever's closest. I'm assuming it's like Hagen or something. I was like, I want to run away again. I mean, like, <laughs> I ha I have yeah, sure. I have spells that can help with that. Yeah, well, yeah <laughs> sure, whatever. Deal. She holds her hand out for like anybody really to shake it. I, I put my hand out, but then I go too slow. Anybody else who's got some <laughs> level of maturity want to shake on this? Uh, yeah, Hobnob's in the kitchen. You can shake his hand. <laughs> shake Hobnob's hand. Do it. How about you, Gelly? Kelly's having like an existential <laughs> crisis. I'm like actually <laughs> thinking through it as if I'm her right now going. I think she should be able to decide for herself, but mm -hmm. I can promise that if you win, I won't kidnap her again. You didn't kidnap me. 
close enough. Good for me. <laughs> okay, Kelly will shake on that. And then Justice just storms off. Man, I mean, I think I think they mean well. You smell like spoiled milk. Wow, that's rough. Hey, Why are you guys? If she like... tries to make you stay. Just break her nose. Trust me, it works great. <laughs> oh, God. You got it. Uh, Verity, your dad, like, turns to you and she said, um, uh, he says, um, well, Verity, you know, we're just so worried about you out there. If, if anything were ever to happen to you, we, I, I don't know, you know, it's, I just think about it. It's, it's oh, really dad, 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 I'm sorry, dad, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I just, I love you dad, so eggs. much, Verity. Dad, eggs. I love you too, dad. Eggs. At least sit down. Yeah. I'm not cooked all this yeah. food. You got it, Dad. You're great. It's fine. It's safe out there. Just, <laughs> just this is just for us. Yeah. She worked so hard to like keep all of us safe, and and she just wants she? she just wants to keep you okay too. You know. It's you should. Right? You should be so hard on her. Uh huh. Yeah, the family's so. really big with the guilt. Yeah. 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 I, yeah. I'm sorry. Just, I didn't. Just... I didn't mean to make you feel bad about. You know, going yes, you and did. becoming your own person. Uh -huh. Still going. I just, yep. I, okay. I, I, love you too, Dad. Love you, Dad. Dad, love you. I, cool. I mean, he's not wrong. It's not safe out having, there. I hope so you're it's definitely fun not. Absolutely. I mean, he's not wrong for that. With your friend, Dad, letting Dad. your six year old just run out in the wild. Yeah, I don't Dad, fault Dad, him. Dad, do you want me to get you some tea? You want some tea, Dad? No, I've got it. I, I got okay. it. Okay. Okay. I feel like I owe him like a gift basket or something. <laughs> um, we can come up with something for him. Yeah. And some oils. Some mm -hmm. non-murderous cheese. I can give him some jars of honey or something. Yeah. Uh, you but hear I some can... trumpets blaring. <laughs> da da da! Oh. There's like, oh. And then Garo's like, oh, what time is it? Oh, uh, I think round one's about to start. Oh. Oh, jeez. Already? Yeah, I'm sorry. I forgot to mention that. That's also why I came by. Not just to talk about Seaportville. Yeah, but like that was that was a while ago. So much has happened. Okay, so a lot, lot going on in this room. Real weird energy I've been seeing. Yeah, we should get to the competition, I guess. And we that's team? it for this week's <laughs> roll initiative. Are we a team? End of episode. <laughs> <laughs> and cut. Oh, man. All right. Oh, Oh man! Thanks everybody for coming. Um, do we we got some closing words from Steffi, right? Steffi, yeah, Steffi. She I'll usually says point something out. at the end. I don't remember. Uh, I'm sure Verity's dad was like, she stayed up past midnight once, and she got the same lecture as she did today. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just so worried. <laughs> it's like I. It was just a movie night, Dad. Uh, anyways, uh, <laughs> thank you for joining us. Uh, even though if we're not live, we always have something amazing here on RTTV. Like, yeah, yeah, we always play in reruns, right? You know, this show and others. Um, we always have amazing shows right here. And, uh, you know, like OT3 Podcast or <laughs> The Most or What Do You Buy Now? amazing shows like those and uh yeah check it out and like i said rttv is available 24 7. Oh. Woo. okay yeah uh sorry we weren't around this week but we will be live next week i'm pretty sure Somebody um, say something if i'm wrong we will be around in some form next we week. will probably be around in some form <laughs> next week oh because next mind. week is yeah juneteenth Next week is June 10th. Yes. We will yes. not be alive next week, probably. But hey, something will happen. Yeah, but something, something will be something going on. Something will be live. Something will be, live. Something will be, be live. Somebody will be having fun. Yeah. We'll still be around. Yeah. Until we see you next time, <laughs> I've been Alec, your Dungeon Master. <laughs> <laughs> and this has been the party. <laughs> Say goodbye, party. <laughs> goodbye, goodbye, party. 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 <laughs> Thanks for joining Bye. us, y'all. Oh, I missed you guys. Oh. We missed you too. Missed you too, Hannah.